the first day of the 23-24 school year at Columbia County Schools was pretty typical. Buses, carpool, new students, and lots of good mornings. Good morning. Good morning, everybody. Good morning. Hey, good morning, everybody. Good morning. It's the first day of school, and we're welcoming back over 29,000 students. I'm excited to see all the kids come back. All right, first day of school. Yay, we're so excited, guys. I'm pretty excited. I, uh, I feel like I'm ready. And despite what students indicated to Dr. Flint when asked if they were excited getting back to school. Oh, that was a <laughs> <laughs> that was these Evans High students were fully engaged in learning on their first day. Likely that she guessed and it's just a good guesser. Some students may have seen some familiar faces. I've spent the last five years at Evans Middle School, but it's great um, seeing a lot of kids from the middle school, which is actually very heartwarming and um, giving high fives and fist bumps and all that stuff. So it's like I'm, I'm home anyway. But other students are seeing some unfamiliar faces, like new principals. So thankfully, I've been blessed the last three years to be the assistant principal at Evans High School. So from across the street, I've seen all the great things that Evans Middle School does here. I started off teaching middle school, so I'm going back to my roots, and I could not be more excited. Mr. Caraway is one of five new principals and three principal transfers this school year. Also, over the summer, the construction of several classroom additions was completed. Opening three new additions, we have Harlem Middle School, we have Columbia Middle School, and Uchi Creek Elementary School. So we're adding classrooms, and we're spreading out students throughout the building, and hopefully re removing a number of our portables. This past Teacher of the Year thinks school has started off on the right foot. I'm excited. I think, you know, with some of our new policies, it's going to be great, especially the no cell phones and no earbuds. The new policy restricts the use of cell phones and earbuds inside the classroom. For the Columbia County School District, I'm Heather McCrone.